Motocon out here, and today we're going to be placing a camshaft sensor on a 2006 to 2011. Uh, this happens to be a Kia with the 1.6 liter, the Rio, uh, but it could be the Hyundai uh, Accent or the um, Spectra. Um, if you got the 1.6 liter engine, all right, looks something like this, or you know, something like that with the 1.6. It's pretty simple to do, replace the sensor. Um, it's right here, okay? And all you do is a little a little uh, slide lock over here. You take that out, you're gonna have a number 10. And if this cover is in the way, these three bolts are also number 10. Just to slide it out of the way because when this is in, it may block it, all right? And I already loosened it. And then you just wiggle it out. It's gonna have a seal, like that. And you get the new one, you match up the new one. Make sure it looks the same, the same connectors and everything. And you just slide it right in. Actually, this doesn't even have, let me see. I don't think this one has, it doesn't even have a, a seal. So it just goes in, there's no O-ring. Okay, you just put it all the way in there, make sure it seats in. Yeah, that's weird why it doesn't have an O-ring. Let me, let me see if it's, it fell off and make sure. Okay, no, it does have a seal. It was stuck in here because if there's no seal here, this would cause a vacuum leak. But there was a seal in here, it's right here. But the, the, the um, new sensor didn't come with it. Um, but I have O-rings, so you have to make sure when you order it, you get the seal before you put it in. Okay, see I put the seal right there. That's funny, it usually comes with it. But that's just a note, don't put it in without a seal or use the old one that, that uh, is worn, because it can leak and cause a vacuum leak, give it misfires and everything like that. Okay, so now we just install it. And make sure you, you put it nice and tight, the 10 millimeter. Then you just put your connector back on. All right. Just make sure it's nice and tight, and that's it. Okay, that's a simple one. All right, guys, and you put the cover back on, and that's it. Motor car nut, please subscribe, hit the like button. Any question pertaining to the video, leave them below. I answer all my questions. Uh, if you find this video helpful, I appreciate it. Super thanks. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching.